Good day and welcome to AGK's Vinyl Life. I'm your host, Anthony K. And on this episode, I'm not going to be showing you guys any vinyl, CDs, or anything of that sort. I'm here to talk about another subject, a subject that I thought I'd never talk about on my channel that needs to be addressed, as well as the future of this channel, as I am making some changes to this channel. And yeah, this is something I didn't really want to ever have to do on my channel, but I think I have to now. Um, and that's because, as the title of this video indicates, there's this cesspool of hate and trolls in the vinyl community that just love to troll uh, quite a number of members of the vinyl community, upstanding members of the vinyl community, myself included. And it's just hate. Uh, there's nothing funny about it. Uh, some people do videos and they call them parodies. I don't call uh, a parody somebody picking on some somebody's medical problems. Hence, one of the reasons I'm wearing the mask today. Some of you are probably saying, Anthony, why are you wearing a mask? Well, unfortunately, uh, just less than t just about two weeks ago, uh, people know that I've been struggling with a dental situation the last couple of years. Um, I take a medication that is unfortunately killed my teeth and they are all, all dying and slowly falling out and so on and it's it's an unfortunate side effect though and it is what it is i was self-conscious when it first happened to a couple of my front teeth i was self-conscious here on the channel uh, and wore and masked up for a couple of episodes but people are like anthony don't worry about it you have great videos blah 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 don't be afraid to sh don't don't worry about your teeth well about two weeks ago uh, I lost a number of teeth uh, when I was just simply eating uh, dinner with my daughter uh, one night and I lost a few more teeth. They just came out while I was eating. Uh, and that has really made me self-conscious because they're in the front. Um, it's very noticeable and I don't feel good with myself anymore. Certainly for doing something like this, we're being on camera, filming videos for you guys and, and working hard on these episodes. I don't particularly want to have to be masked up in every episode. Uh, getting my teeth repaired is not in the short term for me. It's going to be a long, involved process having because I have to have them all pulled, plates made, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to get into that boring stuff for you guys. Uh, but I have been feeling very, very down about my teeth situation the last couple of weeks and deciding what am I going to do with my channel because I certainly don't want to be masked in all my videos and I don't feel comfortable letting you guys see me the way I am now. So there will be no more episodes from me like this in front of my background uh, with me out there for you. I will not be filming any more of those style of episodes uh, for channel content. Uh, I may have to think, rethink how I film videos. Maybe I'll just be showing you guys vinyl, but you won't be seeing me. You'll be hearing my voice and maybe a camera down on the table. I don't know. I'm going to have to give it some thought. But in the short term, there'll be no more videos like this, episodic videos on my channel. And if you guys have noticed, I've actually uh, reorganized my channel uh, in the last week, I'm pushing uh, all my concert videos as being the, the main focus of the channel, followed by interviews, then followed by uh, vlogs and episodes and shorts and so on and so forth. Um, but I'll get into that a little more in just a second, but I do want to address the troll situation. Now, when I first made this video, I thought about calling out the trolls by name um, that have been harassing me. Um, but honestly, that makes me no better than them. And I don't want to give them any traction. I don't want to give them any views on their channel, on their videos. I couldn't care less. I don't watch their videos. Uh, I unfortunately found out uh, uh, last week about a, a so-called parody video about me, which was attacking my dental situation. Uh, a certain member of the community made a, a parody uh, short attacking my situation, my dental situation, and I think that's just cruel. Uh, absolutely cruel. There's just no excuse for, for attacking something, somebody's medical situation. So I was disgusted by that. And shortly after that, another uh, member of the vinyl community made a took to the live stream and started a live stream with the sole purpose of bashing me uh, and my teeth and my situation with my teeth 
and making assumptions about my life and my record collection and my finances. And as I said to that person, I was contacted to say, so-and-so, somebody's to make it doing a live stream about, about you right now. So I looked this person up, went over there, put in the comments just, and I'll say it here, stay the fuck out of my personal life. You wanna bash my channel? You wanna bash my records, my DVDs, the things I do for AGK's Vinyl Life? You wanna bash those? Hey, be my guest, but don't bash my personal life. Stay the fuck out of my personal life. Simple as that. Stay the fuck out of my personal life. I don't need your judgments. I don't need your opinions on how I run my life, my personal life. Stay the fuck out of it. Simple, done. That's all I have to say. And I gather uh, there's been a couple more uh, hit pieces done on me. Uh, I've been, you know, people message me and I've even told, telling those people, please don't message me about people doing hit videos on me. I don't care about hit videos. I'm not going to watch them. I'm not going to go to their channel and give them traction in any way, shape or form. So if you losers want to make a hit piece on me, be my guest. I don't care. I'm not going to watch them. Uh, nobody's going to watch them except people of like mind. Uh, so you're welcome to your, to your Cretans and scumbags that watch your videos and, and post and, and chime in on your videos. I don't care. I don't care. I ain't going to watch any of them. I used to be part of a community about a year and a half ago and I realized that community was toxic and that they uh, made fun of members of the vinyl community. I was privy to personal private chats uh, between members of this community and I was disgusted in the things that I saw uh, in, the, in the things that I was shown from private chats of these of these people but like i said i'm not going to call these people out i'm not going to give them traction i'm not going to watch their videos i don't care do what you want i don't care i'm not interested i washed my hands of this group of people like a year and a half ago i deleted them i blocked them i unfollowed them i have nothing to do with them if they show up in live streams where i happen to be i'll tell them to fuck off i don't mind i have no filter I'll tell them to fuck off. You show up where I am, you're not welcome. Simple as that. And that's all I'm going to say about it. If you want to know more about this situation, uh, I talked in depth about it on Rachel's ghost channel on her TV show where I'm welcome. And I'm welcomed by the community there. A community that has such members as Melinda Murphy and Norman Maslov and a lot of very, very popular and uh, well-loved channels who love me who support me and those are the people I'm going to be around people that support me and appreciate me simple as that so you know because of all this trolling me because of people thinking it's right to attack people for their medical problems I think that's the lowest form uh, of a lowest form of human being on the planet when you attack somebody for their medical issues and you and give opinions on their life like stay the fuck out of it you know stay the fuck out of it and that's why I said a cesspool of hate because these people all swim around in this cesspool of hate and it's gone on in the vinyl community long enough and it has to stop uh, but it won't because there will always be haters out there I've had haters in my career uh, especially the career I've been in being a photo uh, um, a photo photographer that does boudoir and nude photography for many years obviously I had to deal with hate in that business and I did and I put up with it uh, but I never thought I'd have to deal with hate in the vinyl community. Uh, I have bigger problems in my life to deal with than some people on the internet. Bigger problems. So that brings me back around to my channel. Uh, like I said, now with my situation being what it is, uh, I, I'm not going to show my face on camera other than on live streams. Um, there's two live streams that I do go to uh, part of the time. Uh, and that is, of course, Rachel's Ghost TV show. You can find me there on Saturday mornings. Uh, not every Saturday morning, but some Saturday mornings you can find me there normally around the last hour of the show I drop by. And I will be masked up for that uh, just because, I, like I said, I don't feel comfortable being without a mask until this is all fixed. I also appear Sunday afternoons on another show. Um, and people know what show that is. And if anybody is interested in what that show is, uh, just message me on Instagram or something and uh, I'll let you know what, where else I appear. But I also appear on another show, a show where, that has no drama, where we show records and talk about movies. And that's the only times I'll be on camera, I think, going forward. 
uh, certainly for content for this channel. Uh, for the future, for now, there'll be no more content uh, filmed with me on camera for my channel. I just don't feel confident about it. Um, and I don't need any more hate and parody videos and trolling videos about me, though there probably will be. <laughs> uh, and that's that. But I will be continuing to do my uh, artist in one minute shorts. I'll be I'll be resuming them. I haven't done one since last year, uh, 2023. So I'll be resuming my uh, artist in one minute short videos that I've been doing. They were very popular. I will continue doing shorts uh, because I'm not on cam in my shorts. Uh, and of course, there'll be more live concerts. I'm going to a number of live concerts. I'm blessed to have somebody in the in the ticket ticketing world that get, gets me free tickets to concerts all the time. So uh, I will be adding lots more concerts as I go to them. And if I film film some of them this year, you'll be seeing concerts on my channel. It's going to be more concerts than anything on my channel for 2024. There'll be concerts, hopefully the occasional artist interview and shorts. But as for the episodes about new vinyl and CDs and whatnot, I, you're probably not going to be seeing them. And if you do see them, I'll have to come up with a new format where I'm just not on camera. Um, but uh, that being said, like I said, I do have a lot of personal things going on in my life. Certainly what has to be done here is going to cost me a lot, a lot, a lot of money. So I have become very, very, very choosy as to what I buy in the way of, way of vinyl or CDs now. Uh, I won't be very buying very much at all this year. So I won't have a whole lot to show you guys, really. <laughs> Uh, so far, it's it's right now, today is February, I think, 8th, and I've bought one CD in the entire of 2024 so far. So that <laughs> that tells you how much I've drastically cut because I need money for other things now. And uh, But I will be continuing the auctions. The last thing I wanted to mention is I will be continuing the auctions. You will, will be, the, the auctions will continue. Uh, they'll be probably once every other month, maybe once a month, but most likely once every other month. And there will be one at the end of this month. Um, with uh, Naz Nomad and a new person will be joining our auctions at the end of the month as well. Uh, so watch out for a, 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 a video coming very soon announcing that auction that is planned for later this month. Lastly, one other thing. As some of you people know, I'm a big gamer. Uh, I've been a big gamer all my life. Gaming next to music and film is probably my biggest passion. Probably next to music is my biggest passion is gaming. And many of you know that I uh, am uh, a, a streamer on Twitch TV. I stream gaming there almost every day over on Twitch TV. You can find me there. My name on Twitch is Thunderball7. I will still be continuing to stream games on Twitch TV as I've been grinding it out for a couple of years now. And I'm happy to report that Twitch TV has offered me a partnership now. Uh, I've done my tenure, as they say. You have to you have to stream for so many hours. You have to have so many followers before you're off, offered a Twitch partnership, which means I can make some money on Twitch now uh, in subscriptions, etc. So thank you all for all the love in the Twitch community. Uh, I've been appearing on other Twitch members' uh, live streams as well. There's a number of live streams I've been having some fun with and appearing on their live streams. I don't know quite how I'm going to work it with my mask situation, but... Uh, I will be very, very active on Twitch TV in the future as well, uh, doing gaming over there, as it's just a nice, fun atmosphere over there. So there's that. <laughs> Some more positive news uh, uh, and places you can find me. And with that being said, a short station identification. So that's it. That's all. That's all I wanted to say. I wanted to address uh, this troll situation. Talked about the future of the channel. I've reorganized my channel now. I will be uh, mostly posting live concert videos now. Uh, the occasional artist interview if I can score one. Uh, and shorts and episodic. Uh, the AGK episodes with this great background will be taking a hiatus for, for who knows how long, maybe forever. Just wanted to fill you guys in on all that. And I hope you enjoyed uh, what I had to say. I, uh, you're welcome to weigh in on the comments below. Um, but yeah, auctions will can resume at the end of this month. Uh, be, be the next auction. Auctions will be still happening. You can find me uh, on the occasional Saturday over at Rachel's Ghost uh, there for a, a wee bit. And on another show on Sundays for a wee bit. And that's as far as you'll be seeing me in person anywhere. 
and um, I hope you enjoy the content I bring to the channel for 2024. Like I said, it's going to be mostly uh, live concerts, which do very well on my channel. Um, my, I've got one live concert from last year that's at something like 27,000 views now, so I'm just blessed that people are loving my concert videos. So that'll be the focus of my channel, and I will probably be rebranding the channel name on the anniversary uh, of my channel, which comes up at the end of this month. I will be rebranding and changing the channel name uh, at the end of the month as well, so you'll have to wait and see what that's going to be. Thank you guys for your support. Those of you who support my channel, thank you for, for all your support. And uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm not sure how you'll see me, but you'll see me in my next video one way or another, or you'll see videos coming from AGK's Vinyl Life, uh, maybe uh, in a slightly different format. Of course, the next time you'll probably see me on cam will be uh, here on the channel, will be at my next auction. Thank you guys for listening. Stay safe, stay well, be happy, be peaceful, love everybody around you, and rock and roll.